Human rights legislation doesn't only relate to what states and countries should and shouldn't do. Companies are also required under international law to respect human rights, to avoid infringing human rights, and to address adverse human rights which happen as a result of their work. There are two UN principles which cover how companies should promote women's rights and which are particularly relevant to the issue of gender-based violence. The UN Guiding Principles on Business and Human Rights is the primary point of reference and centers on three principles, protect, respect, and remedy. The first pillar, protect, includes the duty to protect against human rights abuse by third parties, including business enterprises. The second pillar, respect, sets a number of benchmarks that companies must reach in order to comply with human rights obligations. The third pillar, access to remedy, says that business enterprises should establish or participate in effective operational level grievance mechanisms to deal with human rights abuses. The UN Women's Empowerment Principles also outline seven key areas with corresponding steps that companies can take to promote women's rights in the workplace, marketplace and community. Principle number three refers specifically to health, safety and freedom from violence and is amongst other recommendations calling for businesses to establish a zero tolerance policy towards all forms of violence at work including verbal and or physical abuse and prevent sexual harassment and to train security staff and managers to recognize signs of violence against women and understand laws and company policies on human trafficking, labor and sexual exploitation.